my dears and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Pamela and I put out beauty related videos on Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. I'm so, so sorry I left you guys hanging last Friday. Unfortunately, I was suffering from horrible, horrible allergies. I'm one of those people who has allergy problems like all year round. Anyway, today's video is going to be on this look here using the Too Faced uh, Chocolate Bar Palette. I was sitting here looking at her thinking that there are a couple of shades in this palette I have never ever used. You ever find yourself like in that situation where you have had a palette for um, you know a good amount of time, maybe even years, and there are one or two shades that you just never like gravitate towards or you just never want to use. Yes, yes, I am talking about me and hopefully somebody else out there feels the same way. I have never used like this purple here or this color here, but because I've never used this purple, I figured I'd try it today. One of those weird matte like formulas that has just plain glitter in it and that's just that's not my jam. But anyway, I figured today was the day and I was gonna use that particular shade and here it is. So I'm gonna quit my babbling and let's just get right into it. Yes! Okay, so I've already primed and set my eyes. I am talking a little bit on the low soft side because my husband is actually taking a nap on the couch right now, so yeah. The first color I'm gonna go into is Salted Caramel. This is just like a perfect transition-y color. I'm gonna go ahead and take sort of a like tapered um, fluffy brush to apply this right into my crease. same fluffy brush I'm gonna go into the color semi sweet and I'm just gonna place this in the outer edge and bring it into the crease just a little bit back in with that first brush and just blend things out Picking up just a little bit more salted caramel on that fluffy brush Gonna blend that into my crease just a little bit more. I'm gonna use my fluffy brush that I used to set my eyeshadow primer with and place a little bit of that. Oi, oi, my goodness. I'm just gonna place a little bit of that champagne truffle up here. And by a little bit, I mean a ton. My gosh, that is a pigmented shade. Oh. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a clean brush to blend this out. Two hours later. Dang, that is, that is a pigmented shade. I was not expecting that at all. So now I'm gonna go in with Candied Violet. And for this, I'm basically just gonna start with my finger and see how that does. And then if I need to, I will go in with the brush. I am gonna pick up a small brush and wet it so that I can get a little bit more of an intensified purple look. I'm gonna go into triple fudge with that same like first brush we started with, that tapered brush. And I'm just going to pack a little bit of this color in my outer V. I'm ever so slightly going to bring that into the crease. Going back into salted caramel with that same brush, I just want a little bit more of this color again, back into the crease, making sure everything is blended in very well together. And with a clean fluffy brush, more blending. It's all about the blending, girls. I've got so much fallout on my face. Okay, as usual, I'm gonna go ahead and clean this little mess up and we will be back for the lower lash line, yeah. I tried my best with that fallout, you guys. I still got some spark sparkles on my face. Okay, now I'm gonna go into salted caramel and just run that all into the lower lash line. Then I'm gonna take a little bit of milk chocolate, again, placing that in the lower lash line. And then a teeny tiny bit of triple fudge. Now I'm going to take some black liner and apply that into the waterline. For inner corner highlight, I am going to use a little bit of champagne truffle only because it is blinding and beautiful. 
Such a beautiful highlight color. I bet you this would look really nice on the face too. Now, of course, I'm gonna put on a ton of mascara. So for lips, I'm just gonna take my NYX little lip liner in natural, and I'm gonna go ahead and line them. And then for my actual lipstick today, I'm going to use ColourPop's Lippy Stick in the shade Aquarius. Anybody, anybody? And that's all I've got for you guys today. So hopefully you enjoyed me experimenting with a shade that I've never tried before. And I totally challenge each and every one of you out there to sort of go into a palette and find a color that you've never actually like applied a look to because I know I'm not the only person out there who does those kinds of things. To be fair, I don't like glitter, period. I know I'm one of those weird, weird girls who just doesn't like glitter. But uh, yeah, if you like this video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and spread my love for makeup, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye <laughs> Okay, okay. What do you got over there? Ugh. Please! Oh. Highlighted brown bone for days. Where are you?